Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Danishka and today we're gonna try some fruit. Forgive me if I sound a little nasal. My sinuses are a little bad. So since Corona I actually haven't been sick at all, I normally have really bad sinus and really bad asthma, but I've been pretty okay, you know, but a couple of days now I've been under the weather. But we're gonna try some fruit that I've never had before. So this is dragon fruit. I've had the yellow one, but not the pink one. I'm excited, and it's really pretty on the inside. Um, I have some gooseberries. Really weird. Never had them before. This looks like a tomato. It's from Spain. I'm not sure what it's called. I'll do some research, but I'll figure it out and let you guys know. I also don't know what this is called. So it's definitely of the cactus family, and it looks like a June plum. So I'll cut it open and we'll see. This is rambutan. I know everybody loves rambutan. It's of the lychee family. Hair is lychee. <laughs> we know that. Uh, here we have some red currant. Also never had that before. And these little things, I don't know what they're called, but they look like they're of the orange family. So they're definitely citrus, but I don't know what it's called. And... Here we have what we call in Jamaica pomegranate or a foreign pomegranate. Yeah, so I'm gonna have this big one. I'm excited. All right, so what do I start with? I'm gonna start with what I know. Start with the known and then get to the unknown. So, lychee. Hmm. The skin is kind of. It's sweet. I'm a fan of sour, but this one is sweet. It's good. For those of you who don't know, it has like a really big seed on the inside. <laughs> I'm gonna do the rambutan. I'm actually going to do one of each for the video. I'm going to have all of them, of course. This is like a little snack for me. The rambutan is very, very similar to the lychee. Except, you know, it has a hairy skin. And the, the coating is a little softer. Like, it's a, the flesh, let me see, the texture is a little, it's harder. Yeah, it's harder, not softer. It's also sweet. Sometimes it's sour. And I, again, I love sour, but this one's sweet. It also has a big seed inside, just like the light tree. I'm leaving this one for last. Okay. The red currant. Let's see. So they're really tiny. Hmm. Mm. These are sour. Mm. They kind of like burst in your mouth. <laughs> I like these. These are nice and sour, yeah. 10 out of 10, I recommend. Tastes like they've helped me with my sinus issues too. All right, this. I don't know what this is, but let's see. I'm not sure how to eat it either. It's so tiny. Smells like orange. Oh, definitely of the orange family. So it has the same seeds as orange. I don't know if you can see. I'll figure it out. I don't know if this should be eaten. This looks weird. Extremely sour. <laughs> yeah, that's extremely sour. Um, what next? Um, okay, so this is a regular orange. I 
just cut it this way so it's easier for me. All right. It's really pretty. Nice and orange. Hmm. Okay, it's really sweet. It's not sour. At all. <laughs> Okay, so this compensates for the little one before. <laughs> All right. The gooseberry. Okay, so the skin feels a little, the skin feels a little soapy, but I didn't wash it with soap. I mean, I washed them really well, but the skin feels a little soapy. Let's see. Smells Smells like it's sweet. <laughs> okay. It doesn't taste like anything I've had before, but hmm. It's nice. It just has like a strange aftertaste so it's definitely not something that you can eat last it has a weird aftertaste but when you first have it it's really nice all right so this is the one that looks like the tomato foreign tomato i don't know what it's called but i remember seeing on the label that it's from spain not sure how to eat it first time seeing it so i'm just gonna cut it see okay so it doesn't have much of a smell hmm. it's really crunchy it's crunchy like apple It's really crunchy. I like crunchy. Mm. Mm. Missing. It has a similar taste to sweet sauce. Yeah. So the texture is very different from sweet sauce. The texture is like apple, but the taste is quite similar to sweet sauce. Yeah, it has that kind of sweetness. Mm -hmm. It's good. I should have bought two. <laughs> and then we're going to do... I don't know. So, I'm not going to... I'm not going to have any more of these. At all. The gooseberry... I'm gonna finish them, but I won't buy them again. Yeah, I won't buy them again. So I don't really know how to cook pomegranate. But it's so nice. I mean, because I'm doing it just for the video. Yo, it's so juicy. I hope you guys can see how juicy it is. And it's so red. It's nice. Mm hmm. So juicy and nice. Extremely juicy. I've actually never cut it open this way before. I normally burst it open with my hands. 
I mean, if you're Jamaican, I'm sure that's how you do it too. But <laughs> you know, it's so nice. Okay, before I get carried away. And I brought a spoon for the dragon fruit. So like I said, I've had the yellow ones before and they're so good. I'm gonna see what's the difference between the yellow and the pink ones. Okay, it cuts really smoothly. Ooh. Cuts really smoothly, guys. Look at this. So pretty. It's really pretty. I feel like God spent his time making these. Okay, let's go. It's really soft. I wanted jackfruit too, but I didn't get any. Um, jackfruit is one of those things that I don't. So I'm. I smell before I eat and if I don't like the smell I don't eat it I didn't grow up eating jackfruit because I didn't like how it smelled but I have a friend boogie who he freezes his jackfruit so one day I saw it in his freezer and I was like why you freeze a jackfruit but when I had it I tasted it it was so good frozen like you don't smell it at all so I only eat jackfruit if it was frozen I wanted to try it not frozen um, but I didn't get any Hmm. Okay, this isn't as sweet as the yellow ones. The yellow ones are much sweeter. It's still good. It's still good. Alright, so, the final thing, guys. I won't lie to you. I'm funny about texture. So, I bought four of these, these little things. And I said, I was gonna um, try them as a part of the video, but Textra and me, I cut one open and I didn't, wait, this looks different from the one I cut. The one I cut didn't have any pink on the inside. So this looks like the family of the dragon fruit too. Okay, now I don't know if I want to try it or not. I wasn't gonna have it a while ago, I was just gonna cut it open to show you and not have it, but this looks like, yeah. Because the one I cut open before, maybe it wasn't ready to um, be eaten. The inside was all like this, so it was really pale and the texture was really slimy, so I couldn't have it. I don't do slimy, so aloe vera is a no-no for me. It reminded me of aloe vera. Okay, this has a lot of seeds, so it's very seedy. It's okay. I wouldn't buy it again, but it's not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. All right, guys, I hope you enjoy. If you've ever had, oh, this one comes right out. <laughs> if you've ever had any of these, comment and let me know. And if you're willing to try, also comment and let me know. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And you can follow me on Instagram at Danishka Will for my personal page. And for my vegan page, it's at Going Vegan with Dan Dan. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think. Remember to subscribe, guys.